Welcome to another Mystical Perspectives. Today's talk is um, taken from the book Meditation Dynamics by Dr. Paul Leon Masters. It's a book that talks about self-realization, serenity, intuitive guidance, success, and mystical illumination. Meditation does a lot of wonderful things in one life, and it can also help to open us to receive the gifts of abundance, which works on so many levels. And today we're going to talk about the abundance of psychic mystical prosperity. For along with being a state of mind, prosperity is also a state of the soul. Now, we don't often think of that. We think always, well, it has to do with what we're doing, our work, our luck, we think. But it's also a state of the soul. When we meditate, we are filled with the presence of our higher God beingness. This inner state of oneness enforces the conscious state of mind and mental attitude that we need as we go about our daily business of living. That's why it's suggested that you meditate every day, first thing in the morning, and also, if you can, before you go to sleep at night. And sometimes you can take a minute or two at lunchtime to reinforce that. We need to be conscious and aware, and sometimes when we get busy, we forget get out of that center of consciousness where we are aligned with that higher center of our soul. Prosperity, you see, is a state of mind. It's a place in your mind where you experience happiness and peace within and about oneself. You know, it's not really about what people think. We are trained to think that we want to be a millionaire and if we get money, we'll be happy. And believe me, it is not true. I've known many, many millionaires. I grew up in Beverly Hills, knew many stars, and that money didn't buy them love. That money didn't buy them happiness. In fact, sometimes they're even more unhappy because they have everything they need and they still don't have enough. So it's not about your bank account. Prosperity is not only financial. It includes some very important elements. It includes love, health, and happiness. Now, you can experience any one of those elements, but one without the other is not true prosperity. Stop and think about it. What if you had a billion dollars like Steve Jobs? He had more. And he got cancer. And he was having a very hard time with his family. And they were really getting tired of him around, you know. <laughs> he wasn't even happy with the special health shakes that he had personally made for him. Because his health, and he could see everything that he built, was slipping away. So, yes, you can have a billion dollars, but if you don't have health, it doesn't help. And you can have a billion dollars, and if you don't have love... It doesn't mean anything. And you can have love and health and money. But if you don't have happiness, then you're missing out on life. So really and truly experiencing one of those elements without the others is not true prosperity. And you need to stop and go within and connect with God and find out what you need to fulfill true prosperity that does have the abundance of love and health and happiness and enough to get you into the place where you don't worry about money. Knowing through meditation that God is truly within you as the central core of your very being produces the greatest positive attitude of mind for achieving prosperity. Accepting prosperity as a natural way of life 
is made possible by God's presence within you. That is essential. Without that, you will never think you have enough because it's that that you need to be truly happy, healthy, full of love, all the things of prosperity. Thinking that prosperity is a natural way of life keeps the mind open to finding and accepting God's true bounty in this life. And it's so important to keep all of the channels open in your mind as to how prosperity may reach you. If you put out the energetics that you need something, it may come to you in many different ways. It may come to you as a gift or something given or traded to you. So let's do an affirmation about prosperity. I reprogram the mind to totally accept that I am a prosperous person who accepts abundance and prosperity as a natural way of life made possible by God's presence there within me. I'm going to read you um, some more affirmations and a prayer and meditation from my book, Prayers, Affirmations, and Meditation. And here are some more abundant affirmations. Every day, in every way, I am better and better. Every day, my image of myself improves. Every day, my image of myself gets better. I can do anything I have a desire to do. For I am one with God's abundance. And when I am one with God's abundance, I am at one with all things. I acknowledge that God draws to me whatever I need in this life. I open my consciousness to receive that which I need to accomplish that is God's will for the fulfillment of my purpose and soul. There is unlimited abundance available in the universe for me to call upon. I thank you, God, and so it is. Now here's a prayer for abundance. Lord, I thank you for the abundance you supply in my life. I recognize I have many beautiful opportunities so I can express my divine light and so that others may benefit as well. Thank you, God, for the abundant financial support and supply that you offer me in so many ways every day. I gratefully accept all of your gifts and ask that I am open to receiving them. Thank you, Divine Spirit, for all that you so generously provide for me. And I know you will continue to offer the best I can use to fulfill my purpose in life. And so it is. Now, there's an important element to remember in those phrases. One is believing and thanking in advance of getting because time is an amazing thing and we are usually uh, not aware of what the different levels of time bring but right now you're experiencing many levels in time and space and when we recognize that we will indeed get it we say thank you we're very thankful and we may not have it in our hands at this moment but we will And when we recognize that and say thank you, we are opening the door to receiving it. And it's very important that you are open to receive and that you're open to doing what you need 
to receive all the abundance and the prosperity you need in life. Here's a meditation on abundance. Let's sit with our spine erect. Let's be comfortable. Breathing in light and abundance. Letting go of anything that is full of lack or worry. Breathing in the love. Letting go of any of the fears. Breathing in happiness. and Letting that happiness fill every single part of our body, mind, and soul. Breathing in all that we need to be prosperous financially and believing that in our mind. Let's do a body scan, a deep scan of the mind. Go within to that place where you're connected, deeply connected to your soul. Ask for that light of your soul to come into your mind and your body. Ask your mind and see if you can scan your mind to find out if you are open and feeling worthy to receive the abundance that is waiting for you in life. Are you open to receive God's abundance? In this moment, let's be open. Let's believe We can receive anything we need. God has an infinite amount of abundance. So let's breathe that prosperity consciousness into our body, mind, and soul. Let's believe it. If there's any blocks or feeling of unworthiness, we allow ourselves to find out where they came from, clear them out, release them, Bless them, let them go. Release it now. Believe and know that you are here to share the abundance and the gifts of God. And you can have prosperity in your life. You can receive limitless blessings every single day. Think for a moment of all the blessings that you have already that you may be ignoring. Think of the blessings you might have with a friend, a loved one, where you live, being here in your life, And give thanks and gratitude for all the limitless blessings you already have. Remember, you need to be open to receive the prosperity that you have waiting for you. Know that you are one with God's abundance. For you are one with all. You have that spirit, that light of lights, that love of God right there in your soul. Let's breathe it in one more time. Deeply breathe it in. And now release it into your mind and your heart, letting that love in your heart grow and glow. And make sure you have your consciousness open to receive that which you need to live in prosperity, to live abundantly with abundant love, abundant happiness, wonderful health, joy, and abundant finances through God's will. It is so. And we end with thanking God for all of the blessings of abundance and prosperity in our life. And it is so. Thank you, God. We are indeed very blessed in our life. There is so much abundance and such great prosperity we can have. And we have them all just waiting like a cornucopia there. On Thanksgiving Day, we have that cornucopia, that wealth of the blessings. Let every day be a day of Thanksgiving for the abundance and the prosperity in your life. Thank you so much for listening.
and blessings of abundance and prosperity always.